Hi, I'm Alex at HD Labels. Today we're going to unbox the DTM Print LX610E. This is a full colour label printer with inbuilt cutter, so interested to see what we've got. First thing you notice is that on the side of the box there is our PT Create Pro activation code. So we'll need this when we come to install the software, I'm guessing. Right, so let's get this unboxed. Sample pack, some more samples, cut samples this time. Product registration, so really important you register the product. By registering this, you'll get an additional 24 months warranty for free. No brainer, really. There's a quick start guide. In a box, says, please remove this first. So there's our power. Accessories box. There we go, our 610E. Right, so what do we have inside the box? We've got the LX610E itself. We have a power pack, USB cable. This looks like the blade in the knife holder. These, I think, are the support legs for the rear, what the material will sit on. You have a sample pack and then a cut sample pack. You have the product registration, which I said is very important. Complete that to extend your warranty. And then we've got the quick start guide, which is gonna walk me through getting this all set up, I think. Right, so first thing I'm going to do is to turn the printer onto its front, just gently. It should sit nicely. Then taking the right extender arm, so the one without the green, so without the green connector in the cable. So there are two grooves, top and bottom, that this effectively slots into. So. And then slide this across to the end. And I think I'm looking to slide this one across. So this one goes to a point where it's fixed. Right, this leg has a cable, which you need to ensure is the right way around for the pins. Make sure it's seated nicely. I'm just going to put the excess cable, there's a little hole underneath here, if you can see this. Put the excess cable into there. And I should be able to just pop that onto the, and then it clicks home. That's just solid, no cable poking out, it's in solid. Next, we should see the little bag that has the, what I think is the knife holder, but there's also an Allen key and a couple of screws in there upon closer inspection. So let's take those out. So these screws just go in the two holes at the base here. Just want to be flush. So next, we're looking at option five. So we're gonna flip the machine, put the cartridge in, and then six is we're gonna we're gonna put the blade in. So on flipping the machine, I can see there's a cartridge inside here. So if I remove this tape, you'll see in the foam, cartridge is securely packed. So remove this, take the cartridge from the foam, I'll put that in the packaging. And I also Need to remove tape from the carriage assembly. So 
So with our cartridge, open. open the box, it should be a sealed primary ink. Very well sealed. see fairly large this is a dye based ink I have here so remove our tab and then our cartridge should go into the printer and then push down at the back of the tank and close the assembly now we're going to install our blade so we remove the rubber end so you can see our blade in there so we need to ensure this piece of plastic is to the left, and we basically push our blade in till it's home. Can't go any further, and then clip the plastic in. 